I'm Katie and this is Katie Plays Stuff, where I play stuff for you. And today we're starting Madison. Hey guys! So I know it has been quite a while and we are finally starting something new today. I've been getting a little bit more into streaming recently, so just quickly, that link is down below. Um, we're going to be streaming Monkey Island very soon, um, or I will have already streamed it by the time you guys see this video. I'm not sure when I'm gonna be posting this, um, but we are going to be streaming more regularly. So there's a lot of new games coming to that as well. So if you haven't already subscribed to Twitch, go on down there. I am so excited to finally be starting this game today. I feel like I haven't played anything scary in a very long time and I'm in need of something creepy, which this game looks so creepy. So I have the actual disc, right? and it looks horrific um but it says madison is an immersive and terrifying first person psychological horror game which is basically our genre here uh featuring disturbing gameplay and an unsettling and compelling narrative and uh you know that is my thing so i'm excited to get started let's just get right into this normal uh, recommended. Visual hints, photography zones, normal enemies, infinite- Normal enemies? There's enemies in this game? Infinite instant photos. Autosave. And, uh, yeah, let's not do that. I didn't know there was enemies. Actually, I didn't really know anything about this game, to be honest, but I wasn't expecting enemies. Answer you what? Your whole family. Your whole blood. Luca? What the hell were you thinking? Luca. What in the hell crossed your mind? Oh, in Roman numerals. Five, what is happening to you? six, seven. You've ruined our family. What am I gonna do now? What am I gonna do? What am I gonna do now? Dad? Dad? Okay, uh, let's check out this room here. So we got some fucking dad pounding at the door, which is really fucking creepy. Ew, I don't like the movement. Can I turn this off? Controls. Sensitivity. Crap, there's like no way to turn it off. That's annoying. Um, I just don't like the... I feel like the movement's a little like I'm gonna puke. Oh, what is this? Open the damn door. What are these controls, man? I gotta pull open the door and everything? Use. Sunbox is what that's called. All right, I can use something for that. Oh, fucking TV. It's dark, man. It's real dark. From your cousin Romeo. Okay. From your cousin Romeo, Argentina. To John Maxwell and family. Okay. Was there something in there that I could read, though? Hmm. Doesn't say to open it. Okay. I have to find the handle. Have to find the handle of this. Okay. Okay. Oh, 
it kind of lights up a little bit, but there's nothing really over here. Pick up. Oh, what's this? Is there a crouch button? Nope, no crouch. What was this? Oh, it's a handle. Okay. fight my dad or what? Why isn't he talking anymore? I'm scared. Ugh, creeps me out. Let's use it. Also, I am back to my bullshit and I am drinking wine out of a plastic water bottle, so. You are not my son! Okay, let's hurry it up. You are not my son. Hurry it up. Go, 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 go. The priest, the priest was right. Uh, come on. Maybe I can get out what to your grandpa's house. Uh, I, I gotta get out of here. Through grandpa's house, though? Does he live next door, or are we in grandpa's house? I won't be able to go back. Good. We don't need to go back there. We're moving forward. I really don't like pulling open doors, especially when I'm playing on a PS5. This is definitely made for like a computer, but oh well. There's a lot of locks on this door. Can't use that. Getting some uh, PT I need to find vibes. a way out. Before Dad notices, I'm here. Before Dad notices. Locked. Lovely photos. What the fuck is that? Okay, hold on. Let me look over here first. Wasn't there a door here? Was there? I don't know. I've never been here, sir. Oh, it looks like a mirror was here, too. Um, okay. You can't read any of these. Apparently I need something for the clock, too. Jeez. Okay, what is this? is open now. Yeah, definitely getting those PT vibes. Ew! Who the heck is that? Ugh. Okay. Great. And a hole in the wall. It's been 30 years since the notorious multiple murders, 
and in spite of numerous options of family assets, no one had previously purchased her camera. For viewers unfamiliar with the story, Madison Hill killed her own family during the witchcraft ceremony. She was then fatally shot in the stomach by a police officer who had caught her in the eye. And now for the weather. All right, so this bitch killed her whole family during a fucking witchcraft thing. Was this facing towards me before? I don't know. Ugh, creepy. All right, hold on. What is this? Grandpa was just like Dad. Grandpa. Albert Maxwell, 1968. So it's definitely, it's not the last name Hale. So at least we know we're not the family that got fucking murdered. My, my birthday present? Luca, 16. How did it get you. here? And here we have a camera with Luca's name on it. Okay, is it in my stuff? Did I take it? Can I keep it? There we go. And that's it. All right, it's interesting. Must be broken. Must be. What? What is this? Locked. Not heavy breathe like that. It's locked. Alright, I probably gotta use the fucking camera. What? Yeah, there we go. Well? Oh, shake it, sorry. <laughs> what do we got? Absolutely nothing! It's a fucking chair! Does, is the chair floating? Yeah, I can't tell. All right, and the door's open again. But let me... Still locked, okay. All right, I guess we going. So I don't really know what the camera does. Like I can't aim that well. I can kind of just like shoot pictures of random things, I guess. So we'll see how that goes. picture of that? I don't know. How many pictures can I take? <laughs> I think the normal mode it said like infinite or something. I don't know. Can I put this away? Okay. Oh, it won't let me click this. Do I have to go over here? This game is doing like a good job of trying to scare me and I'm just not scared yet. So I guess we'll see what happens. Let's put I this should find picture. a nail or something to hang it with. A nail? Why is this bitch back? I can't stand this. Like if this is the fucking monster I gotta face, it's a sheet. I can't do this. I need a nail. You got a nail? Ah, give me that. Give me, give me that nail that just happens to be in the fucking clock face. It makes sense. Dude, if I turn around one more time and there's that damn sheet. Okay. That got me a little bit. Walked into nothing. I don't know when I'm supposed to use the camera. I really don't. Whew, okay. Let's put that there. And I 
literally talk about not being scared, and it begins. Lovely. I'm so glad we did this. The room just wasn't complete without it. Um, okay. Nothing with that. What do I do now? It didn't even, like, do anything for me. Like, I just took- I put the fucking picture on the wall. I don't know if I should go back this way. Alright, wait, let me- should I take a picture of it? What was the point of putting it on the wall? You know? Hmm. Oh! I almost thought the sheet was gonna be there. Oh! The door's here now. And he's, he's pointing at the door. Thank you, sir. Thank you so much. What's your name? Albert? And it's locked. Couldn't even give me a key, Albert. Alright. Oh, it's a noose hanging here now instead of a light bulb. So I guess taking pictures changes things, doesn't it? Um, uh, but how do I know when I need to actually take a picture of something? Like, this says... Oh, it's playing now? Alright, so I don't need to take a picture of everything. Alright, let's see. Can I go this way now? No. So, what's the plan? door here that's now locked, so do I take a picture of the door? No. Albert Maxwell, yeah, nothing. Albert Maxwell, something, something. I feel like I keep hearing, like, doors opening. Sorry, I'm trying to find something, guys. Oh wait, I can open this. What do we got here? Oh my god, click it. We got a key! Cool. Wait, does that- that doesn't go to this. No, oh, okay. hell has dad been doing here? What the hell is this? Madison Hale dumped her victim. So I guess the dad is like obsessed with the the Hale family or something. Maybe he's gone crazy. Close that. What are all the letters about though? Like is he writing to somebody? Who's he writing to? Albert Maxwell. Serial killer. Matches. And a key. And whatever the fuck this is. find this useful, please be careful. Remember what we talked about. I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Priest Thomas. I know tapes are old, but I still struggle with computers. Okay. So... Oh, there's supposed to be tapes in there. Okay. Take. Store. 
my notebook. So dad's the one who took it away from me. Interesting. I don't remember drawing any of these. Sister's leg. Am I going insane? Sister's leg, mom's arm, dad's head? What the fuck? Also, apparently I can hold up to eight items, which is why I can apparently store items in this safe here. That's interesting. I feel like I was supposed to see something, but I didn't see anything, but I still got scared. Dad said he was repairing Grandpa's house, but instead he's been investigating this woman? What is going on? Is there something going on out there that I just, like, don't know? Ah, Madison Hale, 43 years old, serial killer. Serial killer Madison Hale was shot down to to death by Officer Russell, who has just testified to have found her dismembering her victims inside a well of her property. Madison agonized a few hours before she died. Even though she was shot in the stomach, the killer managed to survive a few hours. Serial killer caught and murdered. Up to four bodies might be involved. The police found mutilated body parts in her basement, which looked almost ripped off from a movie scene, as described. Four dismembered bodies were found in the Hales' house. Apparently, four were the victims. Four were the victims, okay. Witchcraft or mental illness? I feel like this game just has a lot of ambient noise in the background that, like, tries to get you to be scared, but, like, has nothing to do with the game, so... Uh, evidence of mental illness was found inside the 43-year-old woman's Madison Hill's house, who apparently was trying to complete a sinister ritual which might involve murdering and butchering people. Great. Great. Um, is there a way I can play these tapes, though? Is there, like, a tape deck? this door. Come on. You got it. There we go. Alright, now what? It's a little brighter out here. Or was it just really dark in there? I keep coming back to this fucking thing. I do not have anything for that. Okay. Um. Oh. Okay, I can actually use this now. Do I have a code, though? Um, hold on. Let me go back in here, mosey my way back, and see if there's a date that might be good. 43 years old, four dismembered bodies. Is there a date anywhere? Let's see, 43 years old Satanist woman killed uh, her own family during a witchcraft ceremony. Believe it or not, the 43 year old woman was found taking pictures of one of her dot dot dot. Madison Hale dumped her victim's bodies inside a well in her basement. Serial killer was fatally shot in the stomach. Dreadful pictures of the victim's bodies were found in the Hale's basement. The woman took pictures of the dead bodies after dismembering. That's fucking nasty. Um. Is there a date? Officer Russell testifies. Did I read this part? As informed by the police department, the officer that ended Madison's life testifies bef that before dying. The serial killer begged for her instant camera. The 43-year-old woman is suspected to have taken pictures of her victims. Yeah. St. Jupiter's Cathedral. Why can't I? Why did I say it like that? St. Jupiter's Cathedral, the Church of Horrors. After a long history of incidents, St. Jupiter's Cathedral is all the rage once again upon confirmation that it will hold a public wake in the honor of the soul of the 43-year-old serial killer, Madison Hale, who murdered a total of four people last month. The wake will be public and free. Okay. I need a date. He's 
these noises, man? What's over here? Oh. Well, that's just embarrassing. I did not know. Anyway. Grandpa's house. Grandpa's I house. Since he died. Okay. Just see if there's anything on this table. Nope. Fuck. <laughs> this storm must have taken up the power. Awesome. I think Grandpa had a generator in the basement. Ugh. Well, at least I know I don't have to fucking use this thing for light. Great. Uh, Alright, well, I can't see over here. Grandma and Grandpa's room. Locked. Ugh. It smells awful. The pipes must be clogged. Blue knees is real? Blue knees? Who the fuck is blue knees? over here. Ugh. Okay, nothing scary over here. What do we got? Chains? Chains on the toilet? Maybe I can break them with something. Chains on the toilet. And a uh, combination. Right, five left. Okay, that doesn't help. Why is there two doors to this bathroom? That is strange. Ew! Dark. I literally can't see shit. Okay, this, this is a hallway. Hello. Can't click her. Alright, this game has gotten creepy, I'll say. Grandpa dedicated his whole life to clock making. says it is a nine o'clock. I gotta find a way to open this door if I want to get out of this house. All right, all right, we'll figure it out. We'll, uh, we'll figure it out, hopefully. I just, um, What is this about? What is that? You know what to do. Hmm. Okay. It's just red? And help me. Do I need to find more of those? Like, look on the wall 
models for pictures or something? Okay, it's way too fucking dark. Um, go back out. Oh, the light's out everywhere. There's that safe. This is like a fucking dark ass game, man. I'm so sorry for you guys having to watch this shit. still because I don't I don't think I have a combination yet. Dude, I cannot see a thing. Go around this bend. Okay, there's a door here. Gotcha. Open it! Oh my god, move your body and open this damn door. Thank you. Ooh, I hate this. <laughs> and we're back. Dang it. Do I take a picture of you? No. Maybe I should just already know the code by now and like, that's why I can't figure out where to go next. Have I gone down here? How long has this been here? Fine by me. Don't care how I did that, but whatever. Hell yeah! Let there be light, baby! What are you? A record? I can't tell. I wish I could just click it. Thank you. Nope. It is something... Mars and Jupiter! Okay. I don't know if that's significant. Well, the lights are on, so I gotta be able to find a fucking code somewhere. What's that? Oh yeah, the combination. Right, five, left. Do not use. So someone nailed it shut. Get anything else?
just wanna know where the fuck Blue Knees is. Open that or there we go. The hell is this? Record player? Is that what that weird record noise was? Bleach. Locked. scary photo. Is there a date on it? No. But there's Luca Chanel Grandpa. Another clock. Oh, okay. Wait, this looks like it could use this thing. No? Looks like it could use like that circle thing. Well, maybe the other clock needs it. Ah, oh, tape player. Yep. Let's see what's on here. From the moment of first contact, it is already too late. When a demon what? attaches itself to a human, Demons? it becomes a parasite of sorts. It feeds from the host until... It devours every last part of their soul. In most instances, the demon's relentless objective is to get back to the world of the living. If you what want to break that about? link, well, I'm afraid it's no simple matter. I could speak at length about various rituals and procedures, but by far the best way is to obey. Help the demon attain that which it seeks. Only then will the demon leave of its own accord. Usually they enter the earthly plane through certain objects that they use as conduits between worlds. Even if you rid yourself of that object later, the demon has made the contact it needs and already walks among us. In the first stages of possession, the host human tends to withdraw from friends and family, becoming aggressive, so dad thinks... even violent. This is the I'm result possessed? of the spiritual battle HDT. between the host and the entity, both vying for control over the mortal body. The symptoms that indicate that the possession is progressing are dizziness, nausea, and headaches. The latter of which can be so intense as to render the host unconscious for days. The dark entity manipulates its host with visual hallucinations and voices in the mind. Destroying the sanity of the host is for the purpose of making them malleable, compliant. This, this is how the demon fully exerts its insidious control. Oh, and before I forget, several cases of possession saw strange behavioral patterns in nearby insects. Cockroaches in particular. My advice, steer clear of the insects. There's just no way I can't be possessed. There must be a mistake. Those pictures, that leg, that arm, I didn't do it. Dad thinks it was me, but I... I... Uh, 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 oh, God. My head. Uh, a door. A red door. Uh, what's happening to me? Is this what that man was talking about? 
It can't be happening to me. Okay. Open the notebook. Could it be the basement door? Okay. Well, let's go on down, I guess. Wait, so can I really not put this in there? I don't fucking understand. Um, so I'm possessed? I thought the dad was possessed, but I guess not. Oh, wrong way. Yeah, I don't know what the hell is going on, but, um... I guess we'll find out. All I heard was stay away from the insects and give the demon whatever he wants, basically. Because that's the only way. That he'll leave. No signal. know this was down here. Dude, I did not just fucking crawl all the way down here for nothing. That's what I thought. Caution tape. What do you want? Come here. Come on. Come on. I think my cat wants to get out of my room. Alright, you guys. I don't know. It's just caution tape. Oh, I can open it now. There we go. Uh, what? What is this place? This is the well. This is where she dumped the bodies. This is impossible. What's, what's wrong with me? Those symbols. I've seen them before. in my stuff. It says Jupiter. Jupiter and what? Jupiter and Mars? Are there things on here that have Jupiter and Mars? I mean, that's, that's Saturn. That's not even. supposed to be though. Okay. Is there something that looks like that on here? One of these? Guys, I have no fucking idea. <laughs> I'm just making shit up at this point. I have no clue. Looks like a crime scene. Yeah. Uh, I think the crime scene tape really fucking sells it. I don't know. There's another padlock over here, too. So... Clearly I'm missing something. So I have to go find some symbols. Because I don't see anything. Hold on.
use a shovel. That's nice. Um, yeah, I don't know why we'd even want to open that, because someone padlocked it three times. Alright, but, um, I don't know, there must be, like, symbols I'm missing somewhere in the house. I love a good fucking indie horror, where you have no idea where to go ever. Like, I, I don't know if I'm just, like, really bad at these games, or I'm just not smart enough, but I keep playing them. Because I feel like, oh, like maybe one day it's gonna click, you know? Did that work? Oh yeah, oh yeah, it's got symbols. All right, we're going. Wait, can I can I go back and look at this? Hold on. <laughs> Where are my pictures at? Photos. Interact. Yes, I can. Okay, so we got Saturn up at the top. We have a two and a teardrop. All right, now I gotta go all the way back. <laughs> I wish I took a picture of that before. Two hours later. All right, one long trek back. We're here. So, Saturn two, teardrop. Let's fucking do it. Let's see, we got... Lovely. We got teardrop. Perfect. And hopefully these are in the correct order. There we go. Did we want to do this? this up? Did it work? Hmm. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Alright. We fucking did it, man. Do I really want to go down here? <laughs> that was stupid. Guys, I've been recording for an hour, and I don't know how long this game is. I don't even know if it's saving. Wait, wait, wait. Can I save? No, it's not a thing. I don't know. I guess I'm just fucking going down into a well right now. Ugh. Ugh. Great. This is my nightmare. God. Uh, the smell. Yeah, the it's really. Dead bodies. Sorry. I don't know. I'm just gonna start taking pictures of everything just in case. This box is extremely rusty. Yeah, I see that. I Does that bother you? Okay. I'm carrying too much already. Are you kidding me? Can I like open it with something though? Dude. If I gotta go back upstairs. Is there anything else down here? is ass. <laughs> You're telling me I gotta go all the way back up there. Drop some shit off. Alright guys, let's hope this game saves because um, I think it might auto save, but there is no manual save as far as I know. But I have been recording for an hour, so I think that's enough for this one video of this very very weird and creepy game. So next time, I guess we are going to go all the way back upstairs, up the well, through the crack in the fucking wall, and drop some shit off in the storage container, and then I'll be able to pick up this rusty ass box from the bottom of this well. It is just so exciting. So far, I am actually really creeped out, 
by this game. Um, it's definitely dark though, so hopefully you guys are able to actually watch this video. Um, so we'll see how it looks when I edit it, but I hope that you guys are enjoying it and let me know if you'd like to see another part of this. Um, I think I'll definitely record the next part anyway because I'm interested, um, but I always like to have your guys' feedback. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye.